In this experiment, we will build a model to demonstrate Newton's third law of motion. For this, we will need an old CD, some glue, a plastic pulley with a hole in the center and a large balloon. Stick the plastic pulley over the hole in the center of an old CD using the glue. Ensure the edges are airtight. Blow a balloon and cover the pulley using the mouth of the balloon. Quickly place the CD on a flat smooth surface. You will notice that the CD starts moving on its own as the balloon deflates. Why does this happen? As the air from inside the balloon escapes through the hole in the pulley and from under the CD, a thin layer of air is formed between the floor and the CD. This thin layer of air gushes downwards from the balloon towards the edges of the CD. This downward force with which the air gushes out has an equal and opposite reactive force. This reactive force pushes the CD upwards causing it to float just above the floor. This is a demonstration of Newton's third law of motion which says when one body exerts a force on a second body, the second body simultaneously exerts a force equal in magnitude and opposite in direction on the first body. As there is no contact between the CD and the floor, the friction between them is significantly reduced. This allows the hovercraft setup to hover and easily glide over the floor.